write the center and eccentricity of the ellipse 3x square plus 4y square minus 6x plus 8y minus 5 equals to 0. So let us write this in standard form. So 3x square minus 6x plus 4y square plus 8y is equal to 5. So we can take here 3 common x square minus 2x plus 4 common y square plus 2y which is equal to 5 or 3 times x square minus 2 into x into 1 will be 2x. So we will add 1 square and 4 times y square plus 2 into y into 1 plus 1 square which is equal to 5 you added 3 times 1 square and here 4 times 1 square is added so that is 3 times x minus 1 whole square plus 4 times y plus 1 whole square is equal to 5 plus 3 plus 4 so we have x minus 1 whole square 3 times plus 4 times of y plus 1 whole square which is equal to 9 plus 4 12 so we can write here x minus 1 whole square 3 times upon 12 dividing with 12 so 4 times y plus 1 whole square upon 12 is equal to 1 so it is in the form x minus 1 whole square plus 4 plus y plus 1 or y minus of minus 1 whole square upon well, so 4 3 times we can write here so we can write 3 times which is equal to 1 so which is in the form of x minus h whole square upon a square plus y minus k whole square upon b square is equal to 1 so here a square is equal to 4 and b square is equal to 3 so a square is greater than b square so eccentricity eccentricity e is equal to under root of 1 minus so we can write here b square by a square that is under root of 1 minus b square is 3 upon 4 which on simplifying we will get under root 1 4 minus 3 1 upon 4 which is 1 by 2 since eccentricity is positive and it should be less than 1 so we will consider positive root so 1 by 4 root is 1 by 2 and also the center of an ellipse is h comma k so which is equal to when you compare here h is equal to 1 and k is equal to minus 1 so we can say the center of the ellipse is 1 comma minus 1 and eccentricity is 1 by 2.